watching BSG Cast. I'm Nat, he's Matt, and let's get started. It's been two weeks since the Battlestar Galactica auction and frack party in Pasadena, <laughs> and it's time to announce the winner of a 32 inch HD TV. If you were there in Pasadena, or if you've been watching the live episodes, you know that C panel was a huge part of our frack party. Now, we really couldn't have done it without them. They're huge fans of Battlestar, and that already makes them the best in our books, mm -hmm. but they are the best at what they do. Did you ever watch Battlestar Galactica? No. No? Then you were an idiot. So obviously, if you run a web host, work on websites, or just have a website, you're going to want to go with cPanel. So let's get down to our five comment winners. So the winner for the BSG Cast live review of Sometimes a Great Notion is... Kate, for so eloquently offering the theory that Starbuck actually is the Lord of Cobalt, Aurora, Goddess of the Dawn. Now, for my interview with Ryan Keaton, the fan commentator on the PropWorks auction, our favorite comment was from Atari Age, who asked basically, what's going on with Apollo's towel? Is it at the auction? And <laughs> you know what, the funny thing is, it started a lot of laughter at BSGCast.com, oh, but man. everybody loved it, and we actually got to the bottom. We figured out where the towel Which went. Which is hilarious. Which is great, <laughs> yeah, that cracked me right up. Now, my interview with Richard Hatch had some fun comments, but we're gonna go with <clears throat> Brian for refuting Richard's idea that BSG should have gone on for seasons and seasons and seasons more. You've got some great points. It's well worth the read. And I generally agree with, with you, Brian, but I think one more season would have been fine. One more season. That, mm -hmm. That's about it. But anyway, now for Nat's interview with Glenn Campbell, the costume designer from Battlestar Galactica, we got another great chuckle this time from Jinx. She suggested that the crew find a ruined Earth and it was a horrible mess. They get down there, they're all dowdy, angry, and they're at the NBC lot, and they're rooting through these costumes, all from leftovers from Glenn Campbell. All that was left was this. All I found <laughs> was this. And that just cracked me up, so that's in there, too. Now, Matt's interview with Michael Hogan had a ton of comments, with just about everyone expressing their shock that Michael is actually such a nice guy. <laughs> but Buzzy left a comment that was the Canadian national anthem with BSG lyrics. Which wow. Yeah, I, that's that that deserves some props on its own. So it was just so yeah, random. it was too special to to pass up. So thank you, Fuzzy. <laughs> All right. So the winner of the C panel flat panel HD TV is Brian. All right, Brian. Congratulations. Let's get that TV to you right away so you can watch the rest of the season in style. So want to have uh, me and Matt over for a finale <laughs> frack party? Eh? Eh? <laughs> Thanks so much to cPanel for being a huge part of the BSG cast live in Pasadena and essentially making it possible for us to have all these interviews in the first place. Yeah, we all had a fantastic time and everyone appreciates what you've done for Battlestar fans around the world. Thank you, C